Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Autonotom. And I have been busy, as usual. You've probably seen my markers off there, off to the distance. I went exploring and I found some spider spawners, a skelly spawner. I found a bone block skeleton that I was telling you guys in a, in a different episode. I will go back across there and I will just show you what it looks like. So when you come across it in your game, you'd know what that is. Um, also, I went ahead, as you can see, I changed my um, my windmill because before I'd made it out of a tree trunk, but then I discovered that you can have scaffolding, which was quite easy to make, quite cheap if I remember correctly. Scaffolding, there's the treated woods. That's chisel. Immersive um, engineering, treated wood. Three treated wood planks and three sticks will give you six scaffolding, so very cheap. So I changed it to scaffolding so it's easier to climb up to because all you need to do, let's just go down there. Uh, down the stairs, why do you not want to go down the stairs? All you need to do, you walk up to it, and walk up it and you're climbing it. I also put on, there's no way to stay on it, like you can't press shift like you can with ladders, which is a pain, but I put on the kinetic dynamo. I had to take off the, um, I'm going to come down, that's just, <laughs> it's just annoying me. I had to take off the head, if you just right click it like you do with anything else, it will take off the, the windmill cells put on the kinetic dynamo so that the round bit was facing out the front and then I shift clicked the, I think it was shift clicked, the sails back on and the, that's a connector up there I believe. Yep, that's a connector. It's connected, it's making RF and I put down a wire to one of these very nice poles. Those are quite easy to make as well. That's a wooden post. Um, two treated wooden fences and a piece of st and a block of stone and I put a relay onto that so that I can bring the, the wires into the house so I can connect it to the furnace however I can't quite work out how to connect it because <laughs> I know you can connect it through bricks but every time I try to connect through the bricks it would tell me that there was an obstruction and it would show me so you take the wire coil you would right click on the relay or the connector it will tell you at the bottom just below my hud the hud it will show you linking from and that's the position that the relay is on then when i go into the house actually i oh know it's not let me do that so if i get another connector and I would assume you need a connector and you put it on top there put the wire to it and it will show me that and it would tell me that was obstructed okay let's take that out then and let's try again there's my coil it's linking from that now Go outside, link to that, and again it will tell me it's obstructed. Now it's this it doesn't like either. Alright, let's try that. Because before it was going through the corners and it was really giving me a hard time. And I'm thinking, that must be how you connect it. Connect from there to the relay. Hey, it connected. But is it supplying power? No, it's not. It's, if I put, no, it's, it's not supplying power. So I don't know how I would get the power out from the kinetic dynamo to my machines. But anyway, one of the things is to make a, um, a capacitor, if I remember correctly. I was just looking at some of the quests powering up. Next thing is to store power into a capacitor. 
So I think we can do that and at least store it in the capacitor and then I can see if I can work out how to get, because it can't be that hard. I mean, it cannot be that hard. Let's just put, let's put some fencing back across there for now. Let's make a capacitor. Capacitor. Okay, so we need iron, we need copper, we need lead, and we need treated wood planks. I have treated wood planks, good, and everything else is inside. Okay, so do I have iron on me? I believe I do. I do have iron. Because I went mining as well. I, I just do that between episodes now. I just automatically mine and get more stuff because you always need loads of stuff. We need lead. Is that lead? I think it is. Yes, it is. I think it was just one lead. Let's just take a couple of lead. Let's go to... This is the normal crafting table, isn't it? Yeah. LV capacitor. Oh, we need redstone. I knew I'd forgotten something. There you go. LV capacitor. Shift click it all in. And that is one capacitor. Right, let's put everything back in our system. Let's see what we get. Choice rewards. Either a loot chest or another LV capacitor. How do you make the MV and the... And the HV. Not that we need those yet, but how do you make those? MV. Okay, you need Electrum for that. HV, you need... It just goes into... It needs steel for that. Should we get another LV capacitor? I think we should, if it's going to save on resources. But then, you can get a loot crate. It's not... It's it's pretty cheap. Let's, get, let's go for the loot crate. I... I really hope that the loot crate is not going to disappoint me. Let's claim you. Claimed, let's have a look. Let's have a look. What delightful thing have you bought us? Bricks and clay. Eh, uh, yeah. I mean, that's, that's pretty okay. Do I have a draw for bricks? I don't think I do, actually. No, I didn't think I did. Let's put you up there. Uh, yeah, it's about, you know, six of one, half a dozen of the other. Okay, so we have a capacitor. Do we have any visitors outside? Not seeing any. Actually, let's put the capacitor in here. Uh, where should we put it? Should we put it in the wall? As part of the wall. There you go. And, ah. Okay, so what do we need... Do we need a connector to put on top of it? Although probably what I really should do is see if I can find the instructions. But you know what? I don't want to. I want to figure it out by myself. Can I connect? No. Thinking from that and go to this. Let's go back inside. Oh, now it's getting. Now it's getting power. Okay. So we are storing power. Okay, so now we're getting power in here. How do we get the power out? There was something on top that said connect inside, facing side input. So do we have outputs on other sides? I think what we need to do is make another capacitor and have a look at it. I should have looked at it before I plopped it down. Because this is all very unknown territory for me. All right, so the capacitor is slowly filling up. And we needed... Should we have... Actually, we should probably just make a bank of capacitors. So if we get... Five capacitors... No. We shouldn't make that many. Because we could upgrade. Let's... Actually, no, let's make five. Five of those... I need, I think it was about, I don't even know how many copper, that's how many, six, I think it was two copper each, wasn't it? We needed lead, and we needed iron, I 
think you need about 15 iron because it was still across the top and treated planks which I already have in my inventory so LV capacitor how many can we make we can make five there you go I did it right I remembered something and let's take you out of the wall as well hopefully a spider will not come rushing in as I do that we need now a relay you can have multiple connections right if I remember correctly a relay you can have multiple connections but the connector you can only have one Oh, that went on there. That's why the door opened. Okay, so connectors. We have two more. We'll have to make some more, but that's fine. All right, let's put the stone back on top of that just for now. And... Uh, really? Ah, Minecraft, what are you doing to me? I, did, I wasn't even aware I had that in that hand. Right, let's start again. Connect. Yep. And connect. There's nothing out here. I'm not seeing anything on the mini-map. I must have scared everything away. See, all the mobs are just scared of me. They're all scared. At least that's what I'd like to think so. Or maybe I'm just getting lucky. I don't know. Right, so they're all filling, filling up. Because that's facing side, no connection. So... How do I get... I don't know how you get anything out of it. But we'll see. All right, let's do the next quest. That might explain things. Um, enhanced furnaces? What's that? An external heater. Okay, that doesn't say anything about connecting anything. What else? Large item storage, steel production. Okay, before we start doing that, maybe we should get into steel production and make blast bricks. Okay, how do you make blast bricks? Because everything that I've seen so far has said, you know, you need to get into that pretty early because it takes forever. So we need bricks, nether bricks, nether bricks. That means we have to go to the nether. Okay, then guess what we're going to do for today's episode? We're going to go to the nether. Woohoo! Oh, you can, you can tell. I'm just so excited. I have obsidian. Uh, 15, that's more than enough. I need to dump stuff in chests. Uh, will we have a flint and steel? Let's put you in there for a second. Let's put everything into our immersive engineering chest. It's a good thing you don't get electrocuted by those wires, because that would be painful. Wooden crate. Oh, you don't want to go in because you have something in it, right? No. Oh, you can't put the crate in the wooden crate. All right, let's put those away. Um, the capacitors, the relays. I made wall mounts as well. You can make, those are really cool. You can make wooden wall mounts. And you can hang your, your um, relays and stuff to them. So we haven't really needed them right now, but you know, it's a cool thing to make. And they're fairly cheap as well. Let's put you away. Coal coke. Everything else. I oh know the crates can go inside. Uh, 
and let's go build actually this is pretty gone we need to make we need to make a i think a wob tool the wob tools are just slightly have slightly more durability than the paxels than not the paxel than the obsidian paxel there's gold didn't i put some wob tools to smelt oh it doesn't like it do I have any coal? I need to take some coal out. And fire that. Okay, that will sit there for a while. And the wob tools. Let's see, let's put these in here. Alright, let's get some coal as well to put in here to fire up the furnace in here there you go that's better is that going up or down that's going down it filled up but it's going down okay and let me think you need three for a pickaxe one for a shovel and three for an axe, that's seven. Right, and we need sticks. Is that obsidian? Okay. So we need three sticks there. There's my pickaxe, there's the shovel. So pickaxe, shovel, and axe. And then you put all three across the top and two down the middle no why do you not work isn't that how it is i'm pretty sure that's how it is paxel uh golden wob paxel axe shovel pickaxe axe does it have to be in that order yes it has to be in that order great Okay, but now we have, we have food, we have a Paxel. Let's put the Obsidian Paxel down. And also I've noticed in the left hand corner, like, um, and on the edge of the screen, I can see the durability of what I'm wearing. So my Obsidian Armor, which gives me blast protection, fire protection, that's pretty, you know, it's pretty high at durability because I haven't really done anything not um to you know to run down the durability but if you look down in the bottom left hand corner you can see the durability on the paxel and that's a lot 4250 so that is awesome so where are we going to build off our oh you know what i'm going to go i'm going to put it in this house because like i said the help the um the village is dead there's only one old guy stuck somewhere in a house who you know he couldn't get out did i pick up the obsidian no i didn't really oh no i put that in the chest i put that in the chest so i wouldn't put it into put it back into the drawers Um, what did I come in here for? Obsidian. In the chest. And let's go this way. I need to make... I might as well get the obsidian Paxel. I don't want to use my brand new Paxel for something as mundane as chopping a hole in a fence. <laughs> Um, should I put a... I should probably put a gate there. I should probably put a gate there. I'll remember to do it some other time. Just not now. Um, 
Right. Shut the door. And... Is this going to be tall enough? I think so. I did remember to bring the flint and steel with me, didn't I? No, I didn't. Ah, oh, dear. Uh, flint and steel, I think, was in here. All right, let's leave those out of it. Actually, let's bring some cobble with us. Just in case. Um... Got a stack of cobble as well. Because you never know. You never know what's going to be on the other side. I really need to make a pressure plate to keep that door shut. And let's go. Okay. Um. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Okay. Oh, nether gold. That's good. But let's quickly block off that other side that could have so easily have gone wrong oh, I didn't bring any torches with me I knew I'd forgotten something all right but I saw some glowstone right there on the side let's waypoint this quite quick portal And, okay, wow, ores are just as plentiful in the nether as they are anywhere else. Right, let's go up here, nether rack. Let's just go up here and mine some nether brick. All right, let's stand, yep. We don't need much. How much is that? As a stack. And a little bit. That is absolutely fine. Or two, actually two stacks. Let's not get too greedy. Let's go a little bit closer. Don't want to drop down into a hole of my own creating. Alright, we've got two stacks. So that should be plenty. The nether's quite... I heard something. Don't know where you are, but I'm not sticking around to find out. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. It was better than I was expecting. No, we don't want to go out with the cows. We'll leave you two in there, ladies. And let's go back into the house. Right, so we have nether brick. Let's smelt this up. Yeah, we need to smelt it up. You know what? Before I do that, yeah, because everything's in there that we need, let us, because we have a vanilla furnace here, wasn't one of the things to create an enhance, an external heater. What do you need to make the external heater? Because then we could put that to the test. External. What do you need? Iron, copper, copper coil block, and redstone. We can do this. And then we can, yeah. So, I think it was four copper. Four iron. We needed some redstone, I think only one. And what else? Copper coil block. So, copper wire was the copper sheets and the engineer's cutters. Okay, that's all outside. Oh, Skelly, I see you. Oh crap. I just saw a creeper. I am not 
engaging a creeper. You have got to be joking. Right, let's go and sleep. I don't know what happened the night before. Tonight they're all like, yep, let's go after her. Let's sleep and let you burn in the sun. Because that's all you're good for. Burning in the sun. Yep, yeah, you're all burning. Oh, that's not going to stop the creeper, though. Um... The creeper's still there? No, it's... Oh, it's gone. Good, good. Uh, copper coils. Um, did I put... Oh, the creeper is still there, but he hasn't seen me. Okay. Where did I put my engineering shears? They are. They're in here. See, I didn't even need to go outside. And the engineer's hammer. That was... That was annoying. Okay, we want that. So... Actually, let me make a stack of tin. Tin, tin a stack of plates. Okay. And we need a copper coil block. Uh, watching me math is painful. If I make eight of those... That's not enough. Okay. Um, does it need to be a treated stick or just a stick? Just a stick. Four around a stick. Um, cut that in half. So that should give us 40. So that should be more than enough because we already had four in our inventory and then we need a piece of iron and copper coils all around it no wasn't that it or was it just no i'm pretty sure it was copper all around it Iron, didn't I just? Oh, that's lead. Oh, good grief. I didn't have any iron on me. I swear I had iron. Uh, where are we? Iron up here. Okay, let's try again without the dopiness. Iron in the middle. Copper all around. And that gives you a copper coil brick. Block, not brick. And then the external heater is the iron, coil brock, copper, and redstone. That's it. All right, so we can claim that too. Um, let's use the proper furnace. Oh, I had stone cooking in here. I didn't even realize that. All right, so that goes in there. No? Oh, external heater. Clue might be in the name, Shane. Clue might be in the name. So put that what next to it. Oh, I see. Okay. And then that needs to be... Okay. In that case, let's move this capacitor. Let's put down the external heater. What's that that's outside? Let's pick that up. Oh, why did you slam the door in my face? Um, let us... No, it's not what I want. Move that from there. Put the furnace on top. Uh, we probably should have put it around the other side. All right, take that out. Put 
put it round this way. Um, do I have a coil? I should have. I made loads. Is it going to connect from the... Hmm. I don't know if it's going to connect from the... From the battery. Let's try it. You cannot attach this wire here. That's connector. No, you need a relay. Um, do I? Oh, I probably need a connector on that too. Ah, <sighs> uh, connector, connector, connector. Let's make a connector. Um, terracotta and copper. All right. Didn't I put away the connectors? Or did I use... No, I think I used all of them. Alright, let's quickly make this up and then I will be back. Okay, just made the connector. And let's put this out here. And the, that to there. That's working. So then if I put in, yep, that's that. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. That is really cool. So that will, is that, no, no, that's not doubling. No, that's not doubling. For a second, I thought it was all doubling, which would have been really awesome. So that's cooking up, so then we can make the blast bricks before the end of the episode. So let's leave that cooking. Oh, I made a mob farm in the basement. Did I show you? While well, that's cooking, let's just jump down. And of course, now I actually want to jump down. It doesn't want me to jump down. But I made a mob farm in the basement because... You know me, I just saw something. Really? Oh god. Yeah. You can see why I made a mob farm. But why did you sp- oh. Yeah, up there's dark. Let me go get my coil. That's why I made a mob farm, because I'm rubbish when it comes to um, to fighting. But I thought, let me think outside the box. You know, instead of waiting to engage all these different mobs, build a mob farm, they can, you know, spawn down here. There is enough space. It's four blocks high, so that's enough to get Enderman as well. And yeah, so I did that, as well as mining. I should have just teleported. Uh, yeah. It's quicker to teleport. Yeah, what do I want? J. Waypoints. Basement. There you go. It was quicker to teleport. Okay, that should give us a decent number of bricks. So, how many blast bricks do we need? Oh, let's collect that as well. Oh no, didn't collect it. In. Take one and claim. Back. Powering up. Oh no, we are in powering up. 27 blast bricks. Okay, so while that's cooking up, let's see what... what uh, loot crate we got. Uh, did I just... Where did that drop from? Did I just throw it out? I must have done. A mechanical... Oh, mechanical components. Coal coke and copper wire. No, that... I think that's the coal coke. Yeah, I have no space in my inventory. Alright, let's offload some stuff. Actually, we probably need to make 
we let's put the coal the netherrack up here so we put everything away that we need to let's go pick up our coal coke do I have anywhere to put coal coke no I don't um let's leave those for now right blast bricks no that's not what I need this is what I need Glass brick, so... Oh, we need blaze powder. Why did I not see that? That means we have to go back into the nether. Is there any other way of getting blaze powder? From blaze rods? Mob drops? From a blaze? Okay. I'm going to have to go searching in the nether for a fortress. That's what we're going to do in the next episode. We're going to go looking for a fortress. That's it for this episode. Please like, comment and subscribe for more great content. It will help to grow my channel. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.